they can also get wet and dirty. Today we're going to talk about three different watch straps. Welcome back everyone to another episode and today we are going to talk about what watch straps can get wet and dirty. As promised, today we're going to talk about three different watch straps that you can take on any activity outdoors or even indoors and well same as your watch that gets wet or dirty they can also get wet and dirty but as per usual as always we first need to check out what i'm wearing on my wrist today strap that can get wet and dirty well there are certain situations outdoors activities like let's say you're on the beach and you have your watch on and it's potentially a watch that can get wet and you would go swimming with and then you think ah maybe I don't want to go swimming with it because I have I don't have the right strap on that's a situation where you would need a watch strap that can get wet for example. A different situation is, for example, you're outdoors and um, it starts raining as hell and uh, then you think, I have the wrong watch strap on and it can't get wet, so what do I do? Or simple situations, everyday life, you do some activities outside, you go, I don't know, now winter, snow, for example skiing and these situations where you potentially would like to have a strap that is able to get wet and dirty because afterwards you can clean it same as you do with your watches. I'm going to show you the three strap options that you can use when going outside, going swimming and getting them wet and dirty. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. The first one, the obvious choice, rubber strap. This is an absolute beast when it comes to dirt and water because it not only is waterproof, but as you can see, this thing can withstand everything. The perfect thing, throw this in the dishwasher, get it cleaned, you're good to go. This is really one of the most durable and probably best in slot straps that you can use when you're outside doing activities, going swimming and getting yourself wet and dirty. Another great option are NATO straps. Because of their material, the nylon they're made of is super, super durable as well. It can be easily cleaned as well. Just rinse them off, wash them off, add a little bit of soap and you're good to go. They get super clean. But there is one downside. If these things get wet, they stay wet for quite some time. So not the most comfortable thing on the wrist to be honest lastly my absolute favorite option because <clears throat> drum roll please these things hybrid straps they are in my opinion the best option you can go for because not only are they super water resistant um, because of the 
caoutchouc core or rubber core. Some people use silicon, but don't use silicon. Because of the rubber core, they are super durable as well. It really depends on the upper material. Look for something that is also very durable. And these things, I just threw this one into the water and it's not wet anymore. They are very comfortable. They come in different colors. They come in different materials as well. Um, look for something that has a very durable upper material. And yeah, you'll look stylish on the beach with one of these for sure. And that's it. Three cool options you can go for that work very, very well when getting wet and dirty. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe because I know some of you do not, are not subscribed and sometimes forget. So I have to always say this. If you want, check out my Instagram for behind the scenes shots, some cool stories and well, styling shots of these with watches. And as always, if you feel like it, put a thumbs up. Thanks again for watching. See you in the next episode. Bye-bye.